In this video, we're going to install Postfix on Ubuntu 16.04 to use Gmail as a SMPTE server. Okay, we're going to All right, to set up Postfix on our server, the first thing we're going to do is obviously log into the server using SSH. Then you're going to run sudo app get update and if you are prompted for your sudo credentials enter them and then you're going to run sudo app get install postfix and you're also going to install mail utils all right on this prompt you'll hit ok and then on the next one, you'll need to select Internet Site. Leave the default as set uh, mail name as it is. We'll update this configuration later. Once the installation has completed, we'll now have to go in and edit the configuration files. So we'll, using the sudo user, we'll open vi postfix and then sasl sasl pass wd all right and then we will add the following line to it which is simti.gmail.com which is the name of the server and then port 587 and then you'll also need to enter in your username and password as well using the full gmail user account name And then you'll save it then you'll need to change the permissions on the file so you'll do sudo again chmod 600 and then type the full path of the file and just to confirm we can list that file out to see what the permissions are and they are 600 all right next we'll do more configuration for the postfix server so we will go and edit using our sudo credentials the main configuration file and so there are some things that need to be updated as well as added in the file so the first thing we're going to do is we need to add the relay host which is already here so we're going to make a copy of this line uh, in case we need to make a mistake we know what to revert back to and we're going to add the smt smtp gmail.com and then port 587 and then we'll need to confirm some other items to make sure they are not already listed in here and i do not see them so we'll go in and add the following smtp use tls equals yes smtp sasl auth enable equals yes smtp sasl security options equals and then smtp sasl oops password maps equals hash and then colon etsy post fix sasl password and then smtp tls ca file equals etsy ssl certs ca certificates dot crt All right, now that we've saved our file, we'll exit and then we'll have to update or encrypt our password process file. So you'll do postmap and then sasl passwd and this points to a file that's in the current directory of etsy slash postfix. If you're not in this directory, you'll have to pull out put in the full path to get to that file name. 
and I forgot to do this with pseudo credentials so I'll have to run it again alright and now that we've done that we can restart the postfix service as my administrator account. If this video has been helpful to you, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at almost ENGR.